இங்கிலீஷ் சீனியர் மே நைன்டீன் செவன்டி டூ கெட் ரெடி டென் செகண்ட்ஸ் ஃபைவ் செகண்ட்ஸ் ஸ்டார்ட் ஃப்ரெண்ட்ஸ் இட் கிவ்ஸ் மீ அண்ட் மை ஒய்ஃப் கிரேட் ப்ளெஷர் டு அசோசியேட் அவர் செல்ஸ் வித் திஸ் ஆனுவல் டே அண்ட் ப்ரைஸ் டிஸ்ட்ரிபியூஷன் திஸ் மார்னிங் ஐ தேங்க் யூ ஃபார் யுவர் கார்டியல் வெல்கம் and for the nice things you have said about me i have always regarded myself as humble worker in the vast army of men and women who took part in the great national struggle for independence under the leadership of mahatma gandhi my contribution has been made possible because of the cooperation and goodwill my present job as the head of the state of tamil nadu will i am sure give me opportunities of service to the citizens of the state i must first of all congratulate you on the beautiful setting in which your school is situated and also on the measure of success you have achieved in training these young students properly it is no wonder therefore that your school has been attracting successive governors to pay visits to it i must also congratulate the school children and the staff on the smart turnout and the excellent parade and i am glad that so many of the children have the privilege of getting trained in this school the entertainments that i have been witnessing this morning by these boys and girls have been really enjoyable it is good to see these young girls and boys engaging themselves in fun and giving us also first class recreation at the same time i and my wife are happy indeed to associate ourselves with this morning's function the report of your activities for the past year read by the principal makes an interesting reading i am very happy to find that the pupils live in separate cottages and that they are not given any servants to assist in their work this provides an excellent opportunity for the children to learn to work themselves at home and to stand on their own legs the practical experience which they get in running these homes will stand them in good stead in their future career the principal has also referred to the dignity of labor i have no doubt that these children when they go out will carry with them the advantages of training in this institution mahatma gandhi always preached the great principle of doing one's own duties at home this practice will certainly bring in self confidence thus the idea of social service is deeply rooted in the pupil at a very young age i have no doubt that children receiving such training will become worthy citizens of the country i commend this example to every institution which is engaged in training children as the principal has rightly put it it is this sort of work that develops a sense of responsibility and i am very glad that you are training your students in the right way another point which has attracted me to your school is your system of having a class library for each class the students of the class will no doubt take special care of the books in the library and make use of them for their general education it is noteworthy that you have a number of outdoor activities it is good that your students learn also several arts and crafts in addition to the usual school curriculum the maintenance of flower and vegetable gardens by the children is another item of work which has draw my attention the purpose of education is to train children 
to obtain knowledge for everyday life to mold their character and also to fit them in some profession in later years madras 9 27 september 1970 to the president the prosperous bank of india limited staff union madras 21 dear sir i am in receipt of your letter dated 22nd august 1970 which was placed before the directors i have been directed by them to reply to it as follows the directors thank you for your suggestions contained in paragraph 1 of your representation in regard to working hours they wish me to state that steps have already been taken to decrease the hours of work in the accounts department by the sanction of additional staff before the middle of next month as you are aware the directors were pleased to sanction two months salary as bonus last year it has not always been possible to allow the staff to enjoy the leave earned by them owing to conditions beyond their control but with the increase in staff there should be no difficulty in satisfying all applications for leave from a perusal of the leave records however i find that the number of those who were prevented from enjoying the leave earned by them was very limited in conclusion i wish to assure you the members of the union that the directors will continue to take a sympathetic interest in all matters relating to the welfare of the bank staff and are anxious that the staff are efficient and contented in their work yours faithfully secretary staff